Well, he's one of the top corners in the league. Never shy with his opinion. Josh Norman joins us right now. Thanks for being here. What's, hey, man. Look at that outfit there. Hey, I'm afraid to touch it. He's smooth. I'm trying to look like a Kingsman. <laughs> hey, okay. Whatever you're trying, it is certainly working. And let's talk Thanks, about man. this matchup, Julio Jones going against this Seattle defense. When you're in Carolina, mm -hmm. you face Julio twice a season. Right. We put up the numbers head to head. You really shut this guy down, which is really a guy who's impossible for most people to shut down in the National Football League. Man, it's a mindset. It really is. Going out there, you got to have a mentality. Look, this guy's not going to get past me. And if he do, he's going to have to kill me to try to do that. And for me, that's my mindset. I go into it and I try to, you know, defend what's mine. And, and show me how it's done. You know, I, I'm about his size. Yeah. I'm much better looking, but I'm about his size. 6'5". Well, well, you know what? Statuesque. I'm going to have to take my glasses off. Take all oh, no, oh, 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 This is the, this oh, is the oh, demonstration. This ain't serious. Fist. You know what I'm saying? I got a button out the coat. <laughs> hey, this might want, get a little want to stretch? <laughs> I, want, I need to stretch about 20 minutes, but this is a live show, Howie. I don't have much time. All right. So, so when you, what is the thing that you mix? Is it your physicality? Like you say, your mindset. Mm -hmm. What do you do that's different from what we've seen other people do? Well, me, I like to switch it up. I, I do. I, I don't like to show the same thing every single time because that wide receiver, a great one like Julio Jones, will get a beat on you. And mm -hmm. once he do, he got you. So me, I come up here, I'm going to show press. I'm going to be press 90% of the time because I want to be physical with a guy like this. Okay. So I'm going to get my hands on at first. I'm going to get you with a jab. If you come off this the line. This is a demonstration. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I, see, I told you. I took exactly my glasses on. Everybody got me in the mindset. I went, I went there. I went. Okay. All right. So, so you want to throw them off from the beginning. You just want to disrupt this I route. I do. I just want to give you a quick jab, and then you get into your own um, movement or where you want to go. And then I just mirror shuffle with you. Or I can come off. I can pray. pray and he's bell. expecting that he's jam. He's expecting that jam, and I'm not giving it to him. And then he's going to be, okay, so shoot, where should I go? Earlier in the year, there was a controversy with you. Do, why, the folks at home say, why doesn't Josh Norman just go from the left side to the right side to the slot? Richard Sherman earlier in the season versus Atlanta played him on the left side, played him on the right side, played him in the slot. Didn't play him all the time, but talk about the difference, the subtleties, of how that changes your game, left side to right side to slot, and the integrity of the defense. Well, it's something that you have in yourself. If, if you learn it over time and, and it's like the best player, they want to match up with the best player. And some defenses probably don't evolve to that. Some defenses are different to where they may throw a different scheme off. You know, it's all about the defense and how the coach is So no difference to outside to the slot for you? Well, for me, no. I love it being inside because I'm more of like a nickel now. Wow. Because you can either blitz or you can drop in zone coverage. Or you can play man and beat him up outside in and force him in until you help me. Your middle gotcha. linebacker is right there. So I like to play it, but I'm an outside guy.